Hello and welcome to RTC on Channel 4. I'm Brian Etchison with another episode of Etchison's Lessons. For my first lesson today, I'm going to show you how to seal up awkward bags like this. It's really hard to seal this bag up unless you're using like a chip clip or something. Because when you roll it, it just kind of unrolls itself. I'm going to show you, it's actually a pretty cool way how to seal this bag up. All you need is some scissors or knife and a Gatorade bottle. This is what you're going to do. First you just have to cut the top part of the Gatorade bottle off like this. Once you have the top of the Gatorade bottle off, you slide it over the bag and put the top of the bag through the bottle. Like that. Now, you just fold the top over like this. And then, put your lid on. like that, you have a sealed bag, it actually looks pretty cool. Whenever you get injured, they always tell you to ice your injury, and normally people will use something like this, or this, to ice whatever body part that they injured. Well, when you're using these things, they're great at first, but then they, once they start to get a little warmer with room temperature they start to melt and they start to drip all over you and no one really likes that so I'm gonna show you how to make a ice pack out of just a sponge and a plastic bag that won't drip all over you all you have to do is get your sponge wet Kind of squeeze the excess water out, but leave a little bit in there. Then just put it in the plastic bag. And then just stick it in your freezer. This is a lot cheaper than those other ice packs that I showed you, and it won't drip on you. A lot of people have some hard to reach candles. Now obviously this one isn't very hard to light, but there's other candles that are really deep, like the big ones that have like three wicks in the bottom that have been used for years, and they're pretty hard to reach. Like I said, I don't have one of those, but I'm gonna use this one as my example. And when you can't reach the candle, what good is it? I'm going to show you how to get to those hard to reach candles and all you need is a piece of uncooked spaghetti. And like that, your hard to reach candle is now a little bit easier to reach than just a piece of spaghetti. Have you ever had to fill up a bucket and had no idea how you were going to fill it up? How's that supposed to fit in that sink? I'm going to show you an easy way to fill this up. All you need is a clean dustpan. Notice mine isn't clean, but I'm just using it for example purposes only. And a paper towel roll. This creates a funnel that is very effective and will fill up your bucket. 
A lot of people like to hang up their shoes in their closet and to do this they normally buy these really expensive sh shoe hangers that are commercially sold at Walmart or other stores. I'm going to show you how to make one of these with just a coat hanger. As you can see I've already cut the bottom but that part's really simple. All you need is some cutters that will cut through metal it really took like 30 seconds and all you have to do is bend these like this or however you prefer Obviously mine's pretty rough looking, but it'll still get the job done. As I'm, I'm sure some of you can make a lot more crafty versions of this, but this is what I got to work with, and it does the job how it's supposed to. You're watching RTC on Channel 4, and I'm Brad Etchison, and thank you for watching Etchison's Lessons.